What's up, New Orleans? How you guys doing? Yeah. Um, most of you guys are from here, it sounds like. Yeah, last night it was not the case, it was weird. It was like I was in Vegas, like no one was from here. Um, I'm excited, this is my first time in New Orleans and I love this town. Like, I could do without the urine smell, but like other than that, other than that, it's pretty awesome. Um, I'm glad to be able to do what I love again because I wasn't able to do it for so long. I was deemed non-essential. Yeah, that was hard when you find out that you're not essential. It was tough for me, man, because we have ego problems as comics. And uh, I'm going to be honest, you guys. I had a pretty bad COVID. You guys, anyone have a good COVID? Like, good, no, no, right? It sucked, right? Mine was bad, but like, here's the thing, like, I would get mad at, like, I'm not a conspiracy person, I just think that some of the precautions that we were given made no fucking sense. Like, they weren't based in science. I don't know how you guys, I'm from LA, and I've been, you guys have learned a little bit about me, but like, there is a, there's a, there's one where you would walk into a restaurant, and you had to wear a mask when you walked into the restaurant, but then once you sat down at your table, you could take off the mask. That's not fucking science, dude. That doesn't make any sense. Zero science, that doesn't make any sense, okay? That would be like me wearing a condom during sex and then being like, oh shit, I'm about to come, and then take the fucking condom off before I come. That's not science, it's stupid. Or like the arrows at the grocery store. Do you guys see that shit here? There's the arrows like at Walmart or like Trader Joe's. It, you can only walk one direction in the aisle. As if that's how you get COVID. Dude, how'd you get COVID? I don't know, man. I was at Walmart and they had arrows going one way. I walked the other way and I fucking got COVID. No. No sign. Who made these rules? You guys have stupid rules here in New Orleans still. I went to a vampire store today. Yeah. And you have to wear a mask in a vampire store. Hey, newsflash, vampires don't fucking get human viruses. <laughs> Why do I have to wear a mask when I walk in? I've seen all the movies, dude. They're immune. They heal. Why do I have to wear a mask in a fucking vampire store? It's probably because of the tourists, though, right? Let's be honest. <laughs> There were some positives of COVID though. If I'm gonna be, I'm gonna talk about COVID for like 10 minutes, so just deal with it, okay? That's how I spent the last year. That's how I spent my last quarantine. Um, there were some positives. Like, I got out of a couple weddings. Yeah, that was, that was definitely a plus from COVID. I hate weddings, dude, okay? I do not like weddings. Unless I like really love somebody, like a family member, like I don't want to go to your fucking wedding, dude, okay? <laughs> don't invite me, just send me a thing, be like, hey, can you buy me something for my wedding? Like, yeah, don't make me go. I hate weddings. You know why? I don't like sitting at a table with a bunch of strangers I don't know and making small talk with Tommy Fuckface. <laughs> They only want to make small talk. So, how do you know they're bride and It doesn't fucking matter how I know they're bride and groom, dude. Okay, we're not gonna be best friends after this. And the other reason that I don't like that situation is because then Tommy Buckface, what do you do for a living, Pete? And I don't wanna tell him. I don't, because it, you look at me like, if I tell someone what I do, then the next question out of their mouth, Exactly. Tell me a joke. Tell me a joke. Hey, fuck you, asshole. Pay me. This is my job. I do this. For, I don't do this for free. I'm not gonna tell you a fucking joke. Come on, just tell me a little joke. Okay, you want to fucking keep pushing it? Your wife's a fucking whore. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. <laughs> right? So funny. You asked for it, asshole. By the way. If anybody here has a wife that's a whore, I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't tell people to tell, them, to tell you a joke at a fucking wedding. For real. You guys are fun, thanks. 